The features in Edit enable you to make corrections to your translated file. You will define untranslated steno, resolve conflicts, and make other changes as necessary. Before you begin learning to edit, you will need to choose your keyboard preference for navigating, typing text, and accessing edit commands. Essentially, there are two different schools of thought about keyboarding. Some prefer a standard keyboard, where pressing a key or shift plus key will cause letters, numbers, and symbols to be inserted into the text on the screen. And pressing control plus key, control plus shift plus key, and or F keys will execute software commands. Others prefer a command keyboard, where the software commands are assigned to the letter, number, and symbol keys. This means you rarely have to reach over to control or control plus shift to execute a command. However, because the letters are assigned to functions, you cannot type directly into the text. So, users of a command keyboard will either use a command to open a dialog box and then type the text they wish to insert, or they will temporarily switch to a standard keyboard to type text. Case Catalyst comes with both standard and command keyboards. The default keyboard map is a standard keyboard. The CAT4 keyboard keyboard map is a command keyboard. If you're accustomed to using an older version of Case Catalyst, a word processor, and or other standard computer applications for text entry, you'll probably prefer the default standard keyboard. If you're transitioning to Case Catalyst from another CAT system that used a command keyboard or used the combination of the spacebar plus a key to invoke commands, you'll probably prefer the CAT4 keyboard. Both standard and command keyboard styles are very efficient. It really doesn't matter which one you choose. One is not better or faster than the other. It's entirely a matter of personal preference, comfort, and convenience. If you're not sure which keyboard map you'll prefer, we recommend that you follow the instructions in the Edit Practice file in the training user to try out each keyboard map. In that practice file, you'll also find instructions that you can follow in your own user to cause your preferred keyboard map to load each time you open the Edit function.